I'm Flo Cordova. I'm a rising junior at Duke University. I'm Chloe Bridal. I am a Duke student, a rising sophomore. My name is Anjali Boyd. I'm a PhD student in the Marine Science and Conservation Program. This summer at the Marine Lab, Flo and Chloe are both working on this experiment that we're running on um, seagrass systems and both phenomenal. The work I'm doing with Anjali right now is actually my first research project. This is my first opportunity I've had to do like, true research that might have an impact. Seagrass ecosystems serve as a really important nursery ground for a lot of fish species and other species in general. Without them, our coastal habitats wouldn't be as you know, diverse and um, so beautiful as they are. We're trying to understand if snails are actually grazing seagrass tissue and being detrimental to seagrass, or if they're grazing the algae, which often compete with seagrass for sunlight. We set up plots in our field site. So we have a control, a cage control, and a cage exclosure. And we're looking at how it affects the seagrass and the shrimp and the snails. We want to see how the length, the width, the algae coverage of the seagrass, how that all changes. And so going out there and taking samples, that's what I've been helping Anjali with a lot. In the lab, that's when we go and we process the seagrass. We're learning a lot about experimental design and setup. Chloe, she's been phenomenal and really been running all of our lab experiments. She has started to really kind of take ownership of the research that she's doing now and um, tweaking it as she sees fit. In the process of running these experiments, we realize maybe there's a better way to do the experimental design to test what we really want to know. It's their first time ever doing research. Um, and so hopefully helping them build some just foundational skills and like what research looks like, um, what to expect, especially when you're doing field research and how unpredictable it can be. Ooh, it's opening, it's opening. Yeah. Oh my God. If you hold it. It's been great working with Chloe and Flo. They're both super energized, always coming with really good questions, challenging me. So I greatly appreciate um, all of their help. Anjali's been really helpful because I've told her a little bit about what I think I'm interested in and then she's pointed me to professors and like other people doing research here. That was one of the things that brought me to Duke. I spent a semester here um, when I was an undergrad um, and I was blown away. I think I was on like four different research projects. An abundance of research going on. So what we're working on right now is trying to create more marine science and marine ecology research opportunities for students on main campus and this fall will kind of be like the the first big leap for that. I decided this summer that I want to study marine science and conservation, which is the new major they just added. There's so much about the ocean and marine life that I don't even know about yet. In the fall, Flo is actually going to be doing an independent study with me. Um, so she's transitioning into a project that's focused on sharks. She's also really interested in drones. Working with her as a mentor so far has been great because she's introduced me to so many new people and so many new projects. That's, that's what, 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 I always saw like those people in like magazines or like on websites like doing research. Like, am I that person now? <laughs> 